Oh wait, are we recording it? Yeah, we're recording now. Recording. Oh, no! nice to see you again, man. Big hey, gold belt. Yeah, you already know. <laughs> we're all here again. St Stakaya, right? Yes. Well, I'll make sure I get that right, Ignacio. Thank what's you. going on? <laughs> you again, man. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, well, look, I'm here. Uh, you know, first question on set. You know, first off, how you guys doing today? Hope you having a great media day. Um. Uh, the, for the Prebo, uh, what was, um, what would you say your, your favorite moment uh, working together on, on the show was? Not, not just, just the two of you, but like just as, as your friend group. Ooh. I'll let you I go. would say the carnival scenes. There we go. <laughs> I mean, that's uh, is that what you wanted? Okay, okay. <laughs> I'll give it. Those scenes were super fun we were being ourselves we were able to just roam and be free and i mean that's that's when you have the most fun when the the director is just like have fun go right. any instinct that you feel just run with it and we'll just see what happens and i i love to try new things and the carnival scenes were were, were my favorite okay yeah, I mean, the carnival episode was a ton of fun to shoot, especially like when thinking about, you know, just the friend group, like in general, it's a big episode for for the friend group, you know. Uh, but that was also like the one of the first episodes we shot because um, we shot out of sequence. Um, and the first two episodes we shot were um, Kabir Akhtar's episodes who shot he shot the pilot and he shot the carnival episode, which is episode five. And so it was like it was some of our first uh, scenes together as as a group. Um, and yeah, I also share share that episode and a lot of those scenes are some of my favorite in the season, I think. OK, OK. Now, Stakaya, you, you have an episode that, that I particularly like where you're working with Uncle Jay. I want to say that was. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And you just show up and, you know, uh, you know, you show up and you start working, you show, you show them how it's done. You start digging in and you, you make uh -huh. a little bit of extra yeah. money on the side. And Ignacio over here just can't seem to uh, get a shovel in his hand for more than five minutes. Um, I, I, I really like that episode just because, like, you actually have a one-on-one -on -one time with one of the uncles, like, versus, like, you know, they're all just kind of being in a group and it's one-off. Um, so I just, I, cause I was going to ask like, what was one of your, your favorite scenes to actually work with one of the uncles, but I think that was one yeah. of the good moments that you actually did have with, with one of them one-on-one. -on -one. Um, but, but overall, I, I think I've asked Ignacio the, this, this the other day, which of, which of the uncles was, is your favorite out of the group? I love all the uncles, right? <laughs> <laughs> but I would say for Maya, uncle Jay would be her favorite, because like you said, that's really the only one she got one on one time with to bond with or, and get to know right. and him inviting her to come work at the site is just like, oh, now I'm really starting to feel like, like I'm a part of the family. I can really get to know Rafa more and how he is around his uncle, specifically just Uncle Jay. And that that shooting that scene was really, really fun. It was really hot that day. I remember that. But besides that, it was it was a lot of fun bonding with with Uncle Jay. Yeah, and you guys got to bond over Ferdinkampf and German heavy metal in the yes. band ride up. Oh, yes, I, I, de <laughs> I definitely tried to uh, Apple Music the, the that band. Like I hope yeah. <laughs> hope I can actually try to find them. Um, yeah. you know, sp sp speaking to I had you know speaking to your other friends on set. Uh, they, they were telling me that they, uh, you know, I was asking them what their favorite video game console was, and they were both saying the Switch, obviously, because, you know, portable. I'm not sure if you guys had the time to play anything within the three months, or just in general now, uh, what would you say your favorite video game console is, and, like, uh, what uh, what game you you having the best time playing? Oh, this one's for Sakaya, for sure. <laughs> so, I am a bit of a gamer. PlayStation. Yeah. And my favorite game is GTA. Yeah, it is. I brought my station to Albuquerque, New Mexico, where we shot. And I told the guy, I was like, whenever y'all want to hang out or play the game, I got my game with me. So I'm <laughs> gamer of the group, if you will. Good, good choice. You play GTA online, get your money up. You know, it's like Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, man. 
I'm not a huge gamer. I'll be real with you. Okay. Uh, maybe I should be lying, but <laughs> the truth. So I don't really know what to say. I was just like, oh, stakaya has got this one. <laughs> well, well, let's 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 switch it from from games to 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 movies. Fa- fa- favorite movie. Ooh, ooh, wow, man. Put put him on the spot, right? <laughs> just in general, just in general. Just in general, yeah, yeah. No, no. Um, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I love uh, uh, Magnolia. Paul Thomas Anderson. Love that movie. Yeah, Paul Thomas Anderson. Paul, Paul Thomas. He usually wrong there. Can't go wrong with any PTA movies. Any PTA films. Yeah, that one came to mind. I don't, I don't know if that one's like my all time favorite. It's so hard to like definitively say like that. But that's a movie that I love for sure. Yeah, I mean, speaking speak, speaking of that, like you just just that type of movie. Um, I mean, obviously, like your you and uh, Stakaya's uh, chemistry on set is, I think, is is pretty relatable. Um, I, I think you guys hit it off. I'm not sure, you know, uh, you know, if if you know, it took you guys a while to kind of get the rhythm for things and just kind of your scenes. But I do think that the chemistry that you guys had on set was was like I said, pretty relatable, and definitely want to see more of the relationship between those two characters. Um, you know, not trying to spoil anything, but. You know, your, your character has a bit of a background that may take her away to certain places, but so you kind of don't want to get your hopes up in certain aspects. But you guys did an amazing job, just absolutely selling just just the moments that you had in, in, in the show. Thank you so much, Terrell. That means a lot, man. Thank you. Now, now tell me we're getting a season two, so I don't have to. Uh, I don't have to write. Man, it. I wish I could. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could. Uh, we're, we all, I we all want one. That's for that's for sure. I can tell you that much. We all want one. We're hoping for one. And, uh, you know, hopefully season one uh, resonates with people. Hopefully people watch it. Hopefully people love it. And and that that's really that would be what would get us a season two, you know, so. Well, look, whatever I got to do to let people know this show is incredible. The acting, the comedy, everything on the show is, is 10 out of 10. Like I said, every episode I couldn't put down. I couldn't wait to get to the next one. Uh, luckily, this is on a streaming service, so you don't have to wait for so long. So you can just, if you're ready for your next laugh, you can just hit the next button and keep it. Yeah, moving. you can binge <laughs> them all. They all come out at the same at the same time. So you can you can watch them all or split it up however however you choose. So who do we talk to you about getting Game Champ licensed? About getting Game Champ licensed? Yeah, we can do that. <laughs> oh, 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 like a real game? Yeah. I don't know, man. Well, you you guys are the gamers. Who do we talk to? <laughs> What's the co- what would be the company to get Game Champ made? Uh, without uh, probably breaking any copyright laws. Um, <laughs> probably would just probably be like a Reddit online game or something like that. We probably have yeah. To, like- there's, no, there's no there's no like board game like manufacturer distributor whatever that would like you think actually make that. I mean, you can go Hasbro. You can go Hasbro. Hasbro I w- that's the only one that came to mind, but I don't know enough about like game stuff. So they got the one because, like, it's a game tap. It's a, it's a combination of every game. So without without knocking on the the IP of every other game, you, you never yeah. know. <laughs> um, hey, hey, I'd love to see that game in real life. Uh, as far as far as like you know, just I guess what's 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 next for you guys? I know you got like you know a, a limitless potential ahead of you guys in terms of the acting world, but I know we got everything going on in the world right now. Uh, what's what's the next big thing for you guys? Um, as far as like I said, hopefully that season two. But what's what's next on your list? Um, like you said, hopefully season two. Um, I just wrapped on a few projects, so I am still, you know, out here auditioning and okay. doing what I can to do what I love, acting and everything. But like you said, hitting back on that point, we're hoping for season two. Well, look, I appreciate you guys. Thank you for doing this interview with me today. It's been an amazing pleasure. Uh, Ignacio Sakaya, I appreciate you. Hope to see you again in the future. Absolutely, man. It's great talking to you again. You too. You too. We we'll see. We we'll see you at one of these cons. Uh, so I'm, I'm uh, going to play some GTA right after this too. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah,